What is up, everybody? It's your boy Zani the Greatest, and welcome back to another YouTube video. Leave a like on this video, subscribe if you are new, and we're gonna get back on into this. This is Dragon Ball the Breakers, the best passive skills loadout that I have in Dragon Ball Breakers for survivors. Yo, so the first one we got, guys, is emergency transformation device. Now, this device basically means that whenever you get caught up in a fight or the raider caught you off guard, he caught you like it, man. You, you, you didn't hide properly, you didn't get into that terrain, he hit you. This allows you to immediately transform and transform as an emergency mechanism. Now, the only thing that I would say is the downside to this is that the emergency, it literally is on impact. You have no control over whether you transform or not. And sometimes it becomes a very, 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 very unuseful technique to use uh, in, in that instance. And um, so this is a 50-50 thing with the emergency. I put it on mainly I take it off sometimes when I think that I can, you know, get get through it with a different survivor kit and what kit, sorry, a different survivor kit and whatnot. So that's the first one. The second one is called the trap device. Now everybody knows this is self-explanatory. When the raider is pulling up on you and you think you you can take them out, you set up a trap. You either attack them or you flee. Now I love this because it's actually my last resort. I don't use this unless I necessarily have to because I want to stop him in his tracks. Usually when I'm running from him, I'm pretty able to get away. I'm kind of a sneaky guy. I ain't gonna lie. I'm, I'm gonna let you know. But so when I'm actually using this trap device it's in the last resort when i actually don't have my mobility items equipped or the timer is not fully set and i have to use that as my last resort stop him in his tracks and find somewhere and get get down and hide or something like that so i really do love this device as as a good tool to use as your regular loadout the third one is the power charger i honestly am not going to take this off i honestly think that this should stay on um when your dragon chains level is at zero your power charger allows you to increase that level exponentially gradually as you're continuing the game i'm not sure how it fits into actually doing it or like maybe like opening more boxes makes it go faster or something like that i'm not sure i know you can level it up to make it go faster but i'm not sure if anything in game can change the timing of it and um it's just a very useful device why not have this just so you don't have to worry about actually booting it up on your own it's a good thing to not have to worry about it does take up a space but hey i mean for the sake of the entire game, I think honestly for me, this is like one of my perfect uh, like private slots, lock slots, Just not taking it off at all. All right guys, and the last device that we have today is called High Alert. Now obviously this is not COD, so the High Alert that I'm speaking of is more so um, you can kind of sense where the enemy is, where he's coming from, basically self-explanatory, it's High Alert, you know, it's you stay on High Alert. Whenever the enemy is near, you, you, you know, like all that it's pretty self-explanatory i just feel like these are like basic but fundamental devices to use in game if you're just starting out as a survivor if you just need to like have a basis of where to go and how to hide these each of these items has its own section you have trapping you have movement you have you know um screening like diversion all of that stuff building your power it literally covers every single aspect that you need in this game so i recommend using these guys but hey thank you guys for watching this video leave a like on this video subscribe if you are new we're going to continue with some more dragon ball breakers content this is only season one this is supposed to last till three months i'm not sure we will get on into you guys peace